Hey. Yo, 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 man. What's good, YouTube, man? I'm back, your favorite DJ. Like always, you know what I'm saying? You're new to the channel, you already know what to do. Self-explanatory. Like, we ain't gotta do that rundown every single time, you know what I'm saying? Self-explanatory, you should already know what to do. Right now, just really just pulled up to the club, you know what I'm saying? So I'm at the club right now, sitting in the car. I'm here kind of early. I wasn't supposed to be at 7 o'clock. It's what, 6.30? Nah, 6.40, my bad. Yeah, so, yeah, a little early, sitting in the car. Oh, well, I don't even really feel like going inside right now, because, like I said, it's probably not even talking about nothing, which I know it ain't. There might be a few people in there, who knows, but I'm pretty sure it ain't really talking about nothing. There's probably more girls than customers, like always. But, you know what I'm saying, it's a Friday. It's today, yeah, it's Friday. Yeah, it's Friday, it's Friday for sure. I be getting my days confused, you know what I'm saying? I literally, like, I literally DJ for, like, six six days straight. So, it would be like, I don't know. It would just be whatever. Like, whatever day it is, whatever day it is, I don't be really paying attention like that. When it comes to the days and dates and all this other type of stuff, that's what be messing me up. I need to set my bills on auto pay, to be honest with you. I really don't be keeping up with none of that type of stuff. But they get paid anyway, you know what I'm saying? They might be a little late, but they ain't late enough where they going to cut it off type stuff, so... We all good on that. Um, yeah, so while I'm sitting in this car, I should, because I ain't got no shoes. Man, I got to get myself together. Let me go on and get myself together, and then we finna go inside and enjoy this night. Hopefully, it'll be a good night, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully, it really do be a good night. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Last night, I don't even know what I could say about last night. Yeah, what went on last night? Like last night started off slow, then it started to build up or whatever like that. It was people in there. I mean, girls were getting money, but like, ooh, what? Mm, I say it was all right. You know what I'm saying overall? Y'all seen how the club looked? I mean, it started slow like always, but like it really ain't started picking up to probably about towards the end of the night type thing, like later times and stuff like that. My bad, y'all can't see me, but y'all can still hear me though. Like I'm actually right now, it's the middle of the afternoon, woke up late. Like, I don't know, I need to start getting my stuff back together. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Like, I ain't been in the gym in about a whole month. Like, I don't know, I just fell off. I was like, I don't know. Like, you ever had the moments where you just feel like you got locked back in because you were getting uh, too comfortable or whatever case with, with a situation? Like, it would be any type of situation, your job, anything. Like, you just feel like you're just too comfortable. So that's why, you know what I'm saying, you don't be doing nothing. Or you don't push yourself. Like, you get an autopilot mode, man. And I hate that feeling. So I just woke up today, decided to go back to the gym. 
Uh, man, can't stop back off right. And get back refocused, man. Because I hate that feeling. Like, now I'll be thinking about, like, God damn, I lost so much. I lost progress and I could have made progress. So it's like I'm taking 10 steps back. Now I got to get them 10 steps back and go 10 steps forward. So it's like, now I understand, like, the life. Like, we can't complain about what we had in life or anything like that or whatever your situation is right now. Like, that don't, like, I now I really understand what people say. The situation you're in right now don't have to be the situation you're in forever. But we got a loss of learnings. Like, we dig ourselves into a hole. Like, we can sit up here, point the finger at this person, point the finger at that person, do all that type of stuff. But at the end of the day, we put ourselves in that position. You know what I'm saying? So if you homeless right now, you put yourself in that situation. You sit up here, point the fingers or whatever. You ain't do what you were supposed to do at this time, that time, that time. You ignored this, you ignored that. You was listening to this person, should have been listening to that person. You should have did your own research, all that type of stuff. So it's like, at the end of the day, we always got to point the finger at ourselves. Uh, in any situation, you know what I'm saying? Whether you right or wrong, always point the finger at yourself. Because even if you write about something, you know what I'm saying? You got to think about it. You could have had the wrong approach about it. You know what I'm saying? You probably said it in the wrong, you know what I'm saying, wrong type of way. So it's like, you always got to be accountable for yourself, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can say point the fingers at everybody, but you put them people in your life, you know what I'm saying? Like, in my ass to a certain extent, like, if you know a person a thief and you continue to hang around them, and they steal something from you, how are you mad at that person when you knew they was a thief, but you decide you want to keep having this person around you type thing, you know what I'm saying? So who is to really blame? Is it the thief or you to blame? Because you knew this already, but you still want to hang that person around you where you thought, well, I know this person, they ain't never do it to me type stuff. So, like, always think about that, you know what I'm saying? It's your fault because you in that situation that you in, you know what I'm saying? And you don't have to, you know what I'm saying? I ain't your say I'll be all this because you in a bad situation right now. You can fix it, you know what I'm saying? And a lot of times with fixing, there's better decision making half the time, you know what I'm saying? And be consistent with the decision making you're making, you know what I'm saying? That, that's a lot of, that's what a lot of this is. I ain't gonna be like, lie to you, you know what I'm saying? It's like, if you know your friends finna go do some dumb shit or whatever. Like, even if you in the streets, right? And you know we finna go slide on somebody, right? It's easy to say, nah, I'm good. Stay at the crib, whatever the case. It's easy to not answer the phone. It's easy to do that, you know what I'm saying? So that decision, you know what I'm saying? It's like you ain't going to jail, so you can end up sliding on this person. Now you're putting your life in jeopardy and all this other type of stuff. So, like, be aware of what you're doing, how you're doing it, all that type of stuff. Because, like I said, you control your life. Don't nobody control you, you know what I'm saying? Don't nobody control. Like, everybody can want to be your friend. Everybody ain't going to be your friend, you know what I'm saying? You pick and choose who you want in your life that fits your life, you know what I'm saying? Just because we cool, like we meet each other and we cool, you know what I'm saying? As time going, you start seeing more and more characteristics of a person, you can cut them off. It's easy, you know what I'm saying? It's easy to cut somebody off. Even if you love that person, man, cut them off. If you know they ain't good for you. Like I, like back to the analogy I said at first, like, like it could be your cousin or your brother. You can love your brother or sister to death, your sibling to death. But you know what I'm saying? If they always bringing the drama to you or they always bringing BS or this or that, you know what I'm saying? Even like I say, like a thief. Say they was a thief or something like that. They, you know what I'm saying, always stealing stuff from you and all that other stuff. That's your fault. You know what I'm saying? You can love people from a distance. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got to be in my life every single day. You know what I'm saying? Because I know what you bring into my life. It's BS. So I always be aware of that type of stuff, man. But I'm finna go on and shut up talking. I'm finna work out. And you know what I'm saying? You already know what time it is tonight. We back at the club. You know what I'm saying? So tonight, I'm probably going to try to get a little more in-depth. But you know what I'm saying? Because I feel like I be showing like the same type of clips all the time with the club. You know what I'm saying? I need to start hitting more angles and start involving the girls a little more and all that type of stuff. You know what I'm saying? You know, some of these girls be shy. And like I said, they be naked too. So it be kind of hard to do that. You know what I'm saying? Because I could get them with their clothes on and stuff like that. But sometimes that's hard because I be DJing it too. And that's another thing. Like, uh, man, like, I really need help with this. So I ain't going to lie to you. I need help with this. But I'm going to do the best I can right now with what I got and all this other stuff. So. Yeah, but you know what I'm saying? when I get that help, you know what I'm saying, y'all gonna know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all gonna see better stuff anyway. But you know what I'm saying? Let me do this workout. We'll just check back in later. All right, y'all. I'm back. It's that time. We're gonna make our way to the club. And as of now, really just putting gas in my car. Once I get the gas in my car, then we're gonna dip out, go to the club. We're gonna be at the club tonight. Like I say, man, I'm gonna try to work on getting y'all better angles, better stuff, more stuff in general. 
because it'd be like sometimes it'd be hard, but I'm finna really try today, see what I can pull out, get up, you know what I'm saying? And also too. My fault, y'all. Trying to get the gas right. Yeah, it hit it on the head. It took forever, though. But anyway, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just try to go up tonight, get y'all more angles, more, pretty much just more club stuff in general, bro. Because I really don't be showing a lot of stuff. Like I say, half time, I don't remember because I'll be so into what I'm already got going on, like DJing and all that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like I say, yeah. Like, when you DJ at a strip club, it's just more than just DJing. You, there's so much stuff be going on. So, yeah, I'm going to try to focus and remember to, you know what I'm saying, get y'all better angles and everything else for the for the, for the the vlogs and just continue to do it, man, because I feel like I got to step up my game anyway. So, that's the type of mood I've been in. That's what I've been thinking about. Like, I have to step up my game. So, yeah. So, I'll just check in when we get back at the club. Still in the bed, really just woke up probably about like 10 15 minutes ago. So I was like, skipping, man. I might as well just record whatever. I'm saying, looking rough, breath probably stank. I don't know. My Lily just woke up. Oh, man. Uh, last night was kind of, I don't know. It was lit for us, people wise, money wise. Now, nah. hold on, let me think, let me think that again. To tell you the truth, I really wasn't even paying attention to it. I don't know. I mean, they was working, they got some money. Put it like that, you know what I'm saying? A lot of these girls be lazy. Like, I don't know why. Like, white girls think they can be dancers. They think they finna just get all this money just because they look cute or got a body or whatever like that. No, it don't work like that. No, you don't lie. Man, don't get me wrong. You can make some money like that. You know what I'm saying? I'll look somebody, but you know what I'm saying? You put a little work in behind that shit. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you'll get a bad type. And it's just depending on the girl, you know what I'm saying? She got real good work ethic, and she got the whole package. You want to be winning, you know what I'm saying? It's like strippers. All the girls that want to be strippers. Take work, I'm telling you. Take work, take work, take work, take work, take work, take work. Trust me, you know what I'm saying? It take work. Don't think just because you, you know what I'm saying? Half naked, naked, you entitled to some money. No, it don't work like that, sweetheart. But yeah, man, like I was saying, man, overall, you know what I'm saying? It was, it was all right night, you know what I'm saying? Good night, cool little night. Oh, man. There was a lot going on, all that, but we got through it. We got through it, we got through it, we got through it, we got through it, you know what I'm saying? But uh, I don't even know what I'm gonna talk about because I just really woke up. Oh, man. Matter of fact, yeah, that's what I probably should do. You know what I'm I probably should have gone on here in this video. In the video, I mean, like, for what? You know what I'm saying, like, hey, y'all, the club, show y'all, club, club, club. Within that, y'all seen the girls, all types of stuff. But still, I think I'm gonna go on in this video, and I should get up and just start a whole new video. You know what I'm saying? Keep the work progress going. Just keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. I need to go to the barbershop. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, it looks kind of rough. Ooh. Yeah, man. I'm gonna go check out because I'm just mumbling and rambling. Mumbling and rambling. 
But I'm gonna go ahead and check out this video, you know what I'm saying? Till next time. No, I'm just playing. But, you know what I'm saying? If every DJ fan check out, man, two fingers up, y'all already know. I'm up out of here.